A very good evening to you. Yes, we are launching a brand new one day special right here, right now. For those of you that joined me on a Facebook Live about 15 minutes ago, you had a sneaky peek and you might have already seen it on the website as well. Well, now you can buy it at the discounted price. A one day special we launch here on Hochanda every day at six o'clock. It's where we have fabulous deals for 24 hours now don't be fooled by that 24 hours because sometimes we have sellouts as well so if you see something you like we recommend you pop it into your basket check on out sit back and relax for the rest of the show because we've got the lovely Leone here to guide us through and to give you some wonderful demonstrations Abs and the team have done it again. Wow, this is an amazing selection of stamps. We're already busy. I'm going to hand you over to the beautiful, to the lovely, to the immensely talented, Oh, Leone. Yes. Abs <laughs> isn't here. <laughs> and Leone's going to talk you through the deals. You can, of course, email in at any time and ask any questions. It's studio at hochanda.com. Right. No, it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. That's the website. <laughs> No, it's not. The address. Yes, it is. Anyway, I'm going to go. <laughs> this is the reason why I'm going, because I can't talk. Right, Leone, come on in, and oh. I'll go on out. Du, 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 du. I hope we always have to do this, because it's funny. Although I do like it when Janet walks in front of the camera rather than crawls. There she is. <laughs> that bit's oh, That's a bit my favourite. It's my favourite bit, Janet. <laughs> Never gets boring. Never gets boring. Anyway, hello and welcome. It's lovely to have your company. I feel like I haven't been here in ages. It's only last week, isn't it? I hope you've had a lovely weekend and uh, caught some sun. I've been cutting out and colouring in in the sunshine. Boom! That's, I text one of my friends and said, this is my job. You know, just to make her really jealous because she was going in an office with no windows. Anyway, I know I'm no aircon. Um, okay. I am so excited. When I opened the envelope and saw all these stamps, I was like, oh my word, I love these. I love these. Um, they are absolutely cool. Now, Janet, this is, I think it's about the third lot or the fourth lot she's done of her fantastic little characters. Let me take you from the top. Have a look. Now, I'm going to tell you straight away that there is a massive collection coming up. So just hang fire. Hang fire with, with your purchasing. Now, that might look, the reason sometimes they look wobbly is because the print, can you see the print is on top of the stamp? And sometimes it makes it look a little bit, whoa. can you see it looks like she's got like wobbly eyes? It isn't that, it's because she's got the, the stamp and the print. So let me take you through the characters. You've got all these characters. I've spun that one round so you can see the sizes. So you've got a lovely little girl though with your stripy so stockings. she have got the background with the, the little paw prints and her doggy, which is so cute. A true friend puts paw prints on your heart. Absolutely. This one's gorgeous. Look at the bunny rabbits. How cute are those? Oh my gosh, I love Janet's artwork. I love these. Again, her characters are fabulous. You know, you can colour the hair in however you want. You can colour the dresses in however you want. You can, and I know, I've said this before, and I know it sounds a bit harsh, but you can swap the heads if you want. I know it sounds a bit harsh. Think back, if you're my age, think back to Wurzel Gummidge. Um, but if you're not my age, you'll have no idea what I'm talking about. But you can, yeah, you can swap heads. So if you want a certain body, um, but I know it sounds a bit gross, but it's possible. Um, it is really busy. Look at her boots. Look at them, they are gorgeous. And she's got a little mac on. Um, all the essentials as well, like all the gorgeous little flowers. I mean, if you don't want to use the characters on a card, you don't have to. You've got so many different embellishments. As we go down the front, look at him. How sweet is he with his little doggy? So you've got eat, play, love, and then besties. And if I just spin that round, you can see the size of the stamp. How cute is that? I mean, that is adorable. Whether you're using them for card making, for your planners, for your art journals, for your uh, card making. This one's beautiful. At first I thought they were little clouds and then I thought, oh, are they funny little mice? Of course they're not, the wings. So you can have wings with or without wings if you want. And I love all the flowers in her hair. I think that's fabulous. Glitter is my favorite color, absolutely. The next one, beautiful. She's there with that massive, gorgeous flower. And the actual stamps that she's got, uh, hello, and then bloom. Uh, and rain will make the flowers grow, which I love. And of course, your hello and bloom will go in there, which looks gorgeous. One more from the collection. This is massive. You're getting 34. These are brand, brand new, uh, literally hot off the press. Um, 
they're not on the all and create website yet either um to buy from the shop so if you do want them now is definitely time to go for it look at her hair i mean fabulous with brave wings she flies and then you've got love and flat and i love all these little embellishments because that could be a cloud it could be hills you know whatever you want absolutely stunning shall i show you some finished samples right these have been sent in from the team and they're amazing i'll just yeah i'll just show a couple because obviously we've got the complete to show you have a look at that corey i mean corey is amazing she is the the colorist quite frankly and look at all the detail on that isn't that fabulous i love this i mean that would make the coolest bunting ever wouldn't it um okay so i'll go through the one day special first this is brand new it is your one day special you've got two flexes only 24 pounds and 92 pence absolute bargain and you're saving six pounds if you want to go for your one day special 865294 obviously we're going to say don't check your basket out on that yet because we've got the other goodies to tell you about and then we've got a big bundle where of course you get a better saving the next one oh you need this in your life how cute are these? I mean, look at them characters. That well is. I love their eyes. Um, so you've got your panda, you've got monkey, you've then got the little cat, and then you've got the bear, and then um, you've got the fantastic hen, and I love him. He looks like he's proper in shock, doesn't he? It's a proper like rubber hen, isn't it? Uh, rubber, yeah. Um, it's look, and the sentiment there. It's the little things in life which I love, and then big hugs. Um, you've also got in this one. Now these are cool. The windows. Now. Um, before today, uh, Janet has given us gorgeous little quirky houses. We've now got windows. There's loads you can do with these. Absolutely fabulous. And I love this. The, um, the beautiful lemonade stand. It's a lemonade stand. I love how it could be free advice. I just adore the idea of that. But I mean, that could be whatever you want. It could be selling, I don't know, flowers, because you've got loads of gorgeous flowers. Um, it could obviously be selling craft things. You know, it could be whatever you want. And I love she's given us a little open sign there. And of course, your characters are gonna fit exquisitely within that. Look at that. I mean, is that not the cutest little thing? They are well good. Um, okay, now, if you want this collection, again, I'll show you more finished samples in a moment, but we're doing prices and everything first. You've got freedom price on this. So if you're going for that one, your price is just £32.37 if you're a freedom member. Obviously, if you're not a freedom member, you're paying the full price. Uh, 681302. Again, I'm going to say just bear with, hold your horses, because we've got one more to show you. And these are the brand new stencils. These are amazing. Now, everything else is um, going out straight away, direct dispatch. But these ones, because these are manufactured, I do believe these are manufactured in France. I think that's where Abs gets these manufactured. Uh, but you have got a delay on these. So these are going out 15th of June. So if you get the big bundle, obviously you're going to be waiting until 15th of June. These are worth waiting for. Look at these. Look at how many elements. What are you seeing there? So um, obviously you've got your gorgeous daisies. You've got these that could be um, that could be rainbows. These that could be moons. Just really cool backgrounds. Quite frankly, they're such good quality stencils. The next one. Have a look at that. All them fantastic flowers, whether it's just a beautiful, big, random background you're creating, or of course, if you're making beautiful flowers out of these, absolutely love them. And look at that the sunshine, the cloud, and then all those wonderful flowers. I mean, these create sensational backgrounds. If you just want to go for the three stencils, have a look at that. Isn't that just beautiful? If you just want to go for the three stencils, 19, no it isn't. It's 17 pounds and 97 pence, but, okay. So you've seen all the elements. However, the big collection. So you're getting your one day special. And you're then getting your wonderful little characters. And I promise you, every time you look at these, you'll see something new. You're then getting the three brand new stencils. I'll start showing your finished samples while I turn her on at you. Because the finished samples from the team are amazing. Right, if you're going for the whole collection, you get a further £5 saving. So that means the £6 saving is carried forward. Uh, look at them, aren't they ace? Uh, oh, I would absolutely buy these. Aren't they cool? They're just cool. Um, so, how much? 
Okay, your complete collection, almost 10% of the stock has already gone. So you're getting basically the £6 is carried forward, saving. The £5 is added on, so you've got £11 saving. And, of course, you have got the flexi. If you do want to go for this, your first payment today is £32.95. You've got um, those payments. You know exactly what you're paying every month. I mean, these are a bargain. Look, 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 I have to show you this. So this is how it comes. Thank you, Janet. So that's how it comes. And there's a little open. So you open that. Tell you what, the design team from ABS, they're just ridiculously amazing. You look through them when you open the, oh, well done. So this is why I should say, get it out first. Don't put it back. Look, look at this. And then you go through. Janet put this one on Facebook. Look at that, a little mini book. Isn't that just adorable? Imagine giving that to someone. I love these. Aren't they cute? And every single one of them, look, bye, Janet. Every single one of them tells a tale. You know, every single stamp pack you can use independently. Um, it's definitely going to be somebody you know. It's definitely going to be a gift idea. Or, of course, look at this one on fabric or on your fabric. How cool is that? I just adore that one. And this one, who's this one by? That's by Debbie. Debbie, that's absolutely gorgeous. And what she's done, these are stamped on fabric. So she stamped them on fabric and actually cut those out and put them on. Aren't they fabulous? You see, there's so many things. Let me show you this that Joe's done. Look, see, I love all the samples. It's like getting a box of treasure. You know, some people like jewels and stuff. I'm not one of them girls. I like this. This makes me way happier. If I'd have opened up that box and it had just been like, a, you know, a sparkly ring, I'd, that would have actually quite bored me. This, however, is like, oh, that's well cool. Look at that. Isn't that fabulous? Okay, it is so, so busy. See, and I love that, because that's not actually using the characters. That's just using some of the sentiments and one of the beautiful, um, one of the beautiful little bunnies. Can I just show you one more? There's so many samples to show you. That's well good, isn't it? Look at him. Hello. He's like, where's mum gone? She's gone out to work. I'm so sorry. Um, just adorable. Look at this one. Did I show you that? Or oh, I showed you that one. I put it to the bottom of my pile. Sorry, I do need to have moved on it. Look at <laughs> Look at the mad chicken. Oh, they're fabulous. I adore them. OK, I'll stop squeaking and squawking. Um, right, if you do want this, the big collection is flying. Please, please, please check your baskets out. Brand new, hot off the press. Now is the place to be able to get hold of this one. Um, if you do want it, you have not to miss this. Um, you've got your three flexes, £32.95. Uh, Janet is an amazing artist. Have a look at the website. If you haven't got any of uh, Janet's other designs, please check the website. They're all on there and everything mixes and matches. And there's not, even their characters, they're all really cool. You know, it's one of those you will keep finding characters that you just fall in love with. And as I said, I will actually show you the swapping heads because I know it sounds quite gruesome, but um, it's absolutely possible. And it means you can change the characters so they really are bespoke. They're whatever you want them to be. Um, don't miss out on them. Absolutely stunning. It is so busy. I tell you what, email in studio at chanda.com. I would love, love, love to see what else you've done with Janet stuff i know a lot of you have already got janet's stuff i want to see what you've been creating so email in studio at chanda.com okay it's busy 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 let's get stamping um so what i thought i'd do i've got a, a demo lined up but i'm gonna do a um just a really 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 quick um little put it together kind of demo so the lovely thing about these is obviously you've got all these amazing little characters you've got all these beautiful little um elements so what you could do i've cut out loads and colored loads so they're all there but obviously with these you can just build a scene so for instance for instance let's have oh leone don't do that thing where you just stand and look at them and they're all too cool so for instance if you just literally want to take these so take one of my little characters first of all okay let's have my little character here so say we are any fuss fuss okay we are any fuss no faff Let's just build up a really quick little scene. Okay. 
It is so busy. I'm so pleased. Hi, Abs. I know Abs will be watching. Um, and hi, a team. I know the lovely team will be watching who's created all these beautiful finished samples. Thank you ever so much. Um, it's so nice. And obviously, obviously, Janet, who's done the work, she sent in some gorgeous samples. I love your work, Janet. I'd like to spend a little bit of time in your head. <laughs> Mind you, it probably won't be that much different to what's going on in mine, to be fair. So, look, I mean, they stamp beautifully, really nice crisp lines. Already, you see, that little girl, you don't really need much with these. You will get carried away, obviously, but, but because they're so cool and unique and quirky, you don't actually need to do much with them, do you know? Because they already, I mean, I wanted to just do a dead quick scene just to show you how easy it is to create a really nice, quirky little card before, you know, without any faff. So, literally, taking those. Of course, if you're colouring it in, it's even better. I'm not going to spend time colouring it in just because of time. Now, I've got them there. So, just take my stamp. You know what I like to do? I like to just take the stamping block and then just take the stamp just ink up the top of the stamp and then just to build it up we'll pop that there like that so what you can do then is start extending the flowers out so just ink in the stamp up gently like so and then bend it if you bend it then you won't get, see how cute, then you won't get loads of the little stems. So it means, I mean, you can even, if you're dead careful, you can even get one of the little leaves. Look, be really careful. See, so a little leaf just peeping on the side. Isn't that fabulous? So it allows you, where did I put that? That one there, that one there. It allows you to start building up your gorgeous scene. And I love this because you, these really do let you play. You know, you start building up all your gorgeous characters, but you start building up your whole little, um, I mean, your flower garden. It could be whatever you want it to be. I mean, how cute is she already? And then, but this is the lovely thing about the big collection, of course. I don't know where I've gone and put the plastic. You start mixing and matching. So say you bring this one in. <laughs> Right, that big collection is flying. 20% of the stock has gone. If you want it, you do need to check your baskets out. It is absolutely flying. See, if I pop that one there, because that's gorgeous. So that's going to stamp there, like so. And then I'm going to have on the bottom, this is where I, I mix up all my collections. So I'm going to try not do that. Um, and then I'm going to pop this... I'm going to take this one. I love this one because this is a little light cloud. So that little cloud is going to be over the top just about here, like this. If you use your mask, you can create masks, which of course I'll be doing in a little while. Oh, let's pop that one there like this. And then let's put on the bottom, let's put the word love like this. Now, all I'm doing is a tiny bit of stamping. All you need to do, just play. Play with all your layers. Play with all your gorgeous little characters. What I do as soon as you get these home is stamp them all out. Stamp them all out and look, have a see what they, they look like. Oh, what did Leonie not do? Put the magnets back. Stamp them all out, see what they look like. Um, and then start playing with the actual characters. You know, see what goes with what. See which ones you actually want to, to use for what design. Um, I would try and keep each one on the actual um, on the actual background that they come in, just for ease of use. I'm going to put that bloom in there. Normally, I'd use an acrylic block for this one, but just because it saves me faffing about trying to find my acrylic block. I'll do it with my stamping platform. Oh, perfect. Look at that. Right, I won't do any more because look, add a bit of colour to this and I'm not going to colour it in properly. I'll just take my pencil crayons, which of course I'll put farthest away. Take my little old pencil crayons and then, so if you just popped a little bit of colour on here, I mean, look, as soon as you add a bit of colour,
starts coming to life. How cool is that? Where's my water brush? There. Look. Brink, brink, brink. Like this. Love it. It is so busy. Please, please, please check this out. And please get those photos in. I want to see what you've done with Janet's uh, gorgeous collections before. Because I know that a lot of you have already got her previous ones. And why do you love them so much? Is it the quirkiness? Is it because they remind you of people? Is it just because they're so different and cool and unique? You know, what is it that makes these really, really special for you? I'm not going to colour it in, but you can see already. You know, just by building that up, it'd look better coloured in, wouldn't it? I'm not going to colour it because I can see myself faffing. But as soon as you start adding the colour, do you know what would look amazing as well? Bring the stencils in. And I'm going to say I'm not going to colour it in, but look, if I bring that stencil in, you know that gorgeous sunshine? You bring that fabulous little sunshine. The stencils are amazing because there's so many elements with these. So, oh... Do you know, the, I, this is something with my black ink pad today. I'm having proper black ink pad issues. Do you know what I mean? When you just get black ink everywhere, I've got my brand new sparkly shiny new planner and no word of a lie, I just get black ink. Oh, I drive myself mad. Anyway, look, that stencil. See, this is why you need that stencil. Straight away, pop, done it, look cool. Don't it look cool? Right, I'm not playing with this one anymore because I just wanted to show you how to, to suddenly build up a scene. See, and that, oh man, if, no, put that one back, okay? Because building up a scene, boom, quick, easy. But look, can I move on to proper demonstration? Oh, we've had a proper picture sent in. Let's have a look, who's this from? Belinda, Belinda, let's have a little look, see. <gasps> Belinda, that's gorgeous. Oh, Belinda. That's amazing. Yeah, yeah, that is really cool. See, when I see things like that, it's like, that is so much better than what I do. Your colouring in Belinda's really nice. That absolutely puts me, but this is the thing. Literally anybody can use these stamps, like whether you're, you're not a colourist like me or if you're like Belinda and you've nailed it. Belinda, thank you. Keep emailing in, keep sharing, because I love to see your work. Okay, so this is what I've done. I've already prepped this so it's ready. So I've taken two of the, the windows, okay? So I've stamped two of the windows on a piece of card. I have prepped this because I knew it'd take me time. I've then just cut out the little window panes, like so, okay? So I thought, perfect. Because the windows are so cool, we can start building up. So we've got my little windows, first of all. Now, the first element is going to be decorating the front of this. I love the windows. You've got, of course, within that selection, you've got four different windows. Um, and the wonderful thing with these, you can do tons. Now, I've already started cutting out my masks. And I thought, now, with this, you want two different types of masks because you want a mask so you can stamp into it, but then you want a mask so you can go around it, if you see what I mean. So I've cut out quite a few different masks, and this is the one I'm after here. See, I've been right busy cutting out. So this is for this, and I probably, I'll do half at a time. Right, so popping that there like so. So this is now going to give me the ability to start decorating the background. So if I take the beautiful mask, the masks are ace because there's so much you can do with these. They're really, really cool. So let's start building up that gorgeous background. So yay, we've had another picture. Um, this one's from Jackie. Shall we see? Shall we see? Well, I mix and match my colours. So, oh, Jackie. See, I get a sneak peek. Sorry, folks. Oh, that's well cute. Jack of the race. See the little characters. You've got the little cat in this. And see, how cool is that? Because you had the cat in the other ones and now you've got the dogs. So you've always, always add into the collection. That is well nice, Jackie. Thank you ever so much. Please keep those coming in. Love seeing them. Studio at achanda.com. Um, right, so the mass. Now, all I'm doing is building this background up. This is so nice because these masks will give you so many different elements. So you'll pick and choose your different elements. 
and I've put the mask on the window so I can work over that window. Obviously, I'm only working over the top bit first and then I'll swap it. I'll move the other side. So just working down there. I'm having the stripes going that way, but then I want them coming down this way just because. And I'm going to swap colour in a minute. So I'm having it. Isn't it cool? So pop the mask back over there like so and then bring this down here and I'm watching where that one goes so I've got one there and I'm going to have one here like so now the beautiful thing is with this you've got so many gorgeous stamps I mean I could have wonderful flowers coming up here you know the little flowers that you've got in the the um window box you could have more little flowers coming over the the top because you've got so many stamps to do that and I'd love that I love that you've got so many different things within the whole collection so you can build up so many different scenes gorgeous and then we'll just bring the flowers down here like that F fabulous stencils aren't that isn't that a beautiful stencil um okay flying over 20 percent of the stock has gone you know what to do um you're already loving it and i'm not surprised because they're gorgeous they're just gorgeous and it's another one of those collections you'll go to time and time and time again, which is always marvellous. I've gone in with the blue. I'm going to go in with that, that lovely fire brick. Um, I'm using my Distress Oxides as ever. Every now and again I change, but not often. So just coming in. I'm not putting loads and loads of ink on because I kind of like it a little bit open. And I'm not putting loads of ink on because... Because I'm going to put my characters behind here, I still want to be able to see my characters, you know. So if this is too heavy, oops, if this is too heavy, then I might not see my characters properly. So just pull that off again. So I haven't gone over the window. Bring the top one. Obviously, when you've um, a little bit more time at home, you might make loads of masks i would actually recommend making loads of little masks we've got the masking stuff have a look on the website it's from afix i do believe it's called um and it's really handy little stuff so just have loads of them because i did realize as well that i needed to make a mask that was the whole of the window so when i stamped my character it covered all of this bit i'll show you what i mean when i'm doing that in another demonstration but there we go so peeling that off and you've got your beautiful windows love it absolutely love it what kind of time are we on not too horrendous so i'm happy with that as the the front of my little house i'll just get a bit of water oh i won't because i didn't get my water oh i forgot it i forgot my water i left it somewhere else and i've put my spritzer somewhere else oh are you sure thank you very much indeed Thank you. I'll just get a tiny bit of water on my hand. There we go. And just do a tiny bit of flicking. Yeah, I went and I went to clean my water bowl because it had been sat here and forgot it. I've left it somewhere never to be seen. There we go. So just doing a little bit of that to lift off there. Like that. There's a bit of water on my table, so I'll do it the other way around. Okay. Boom. So happy with the front of it which I think looks really cute now the inside of this because obviously I'm gonna have a little card so this is going to be a little card that I'm gonna open of course but you want to be able to see inside the card so what we want to do is start to plan um, so what we can do is now the best way of doing this is to, to, hold on a minute, let's see where it's going to sit. It is going to sit about there. So my way of doing this, because I'm very lucky, I've cut these out. So um, just pop it around there, that'll be super. Thanks, love. So if I pop this here, now it's up to you. You could, <laughs> she cute. The best way of doing this is start doing it like this, okay? Because then you can decide what you see inside the card. So don't stick anything down. Start to place your little characters so you can decide where they are, but also the scene that they're going to see. I mean, they might want it. You might want it. So it's literally 
So you've got her sort of flying away. Do you know what I mean? You might want it so you don't know she's flying. So it could be sort of like that, so she's just peeping out. Or you might want it more like that, so she's peeping out the window. So say that one's peeping out the window, but what's in my bottom window? Well, in my bottom window, <laughs> I mean, oh, come on. It's just amazing, isn't it? <laughs> He's just one of my favourite characters. So, but I think he's nice with the little burr. So if you have these two, like this, you're just going to end up playing, aren't you? Just because look, when you put that back on there, so you've got the little burr and the chicken. Oh man, I love this. No. So you could have them stuck there like that, but you know what? Why do that when we can stamp? So. We've got that there. So I know I want her approximately there, okay? So if I get my stamping platform, no, my stamp, where is she? Where are you, fairy? Sorry, everyone. She's not that one, she's that one. Okay. And it's quite nice, is this, because now, if you haven't cut yours out, remember, you have got the acetate. So the acetate, you will be able to, to sort of you know, place them with the acetate. So it, you could do it that way. I'm lucky because I've done loads of stamping and cutting out. So I can actually faff with the placement. So I could do a bigger stamping block, but I think it'll just go on like so. So what I'm gonna do is just ink this up and stamp this. So then she's gonna go on here so if I take that away, she's going to go on just there, like this. Have a look at her. Cute! Isn't she adorable? Look at the crispness of that as well. So then when I put my little card, look, she's just flying through. It's like, what is that? And then when you open the card, you're going to be able to see her. Cute! Isn't she fabulous? And then your little character's at the bottom. So let's take her away. And then we've got our little characters. Shall I stamp these and then let Janet do a little bit of a refresh? Shall we do it that way? And then I'll do a little bit of colouring in. So I need my characters, so let's have a little look again. So pop that there, so it's going to be approximately there. Like so. So I want my bear approximately there. I kind of like him peeping in. <laughs> and then my mad chicken, oops, moved him. So my bear's going to be approximately there, and my mad chicken is going to be approximately there. I'm only going to stamp the bear because I'm mad chicken. I haven't made a mask. Perfect. Okay, so what I'll do is, so the bear is going to be stamped like this. Oops, it is. So ink up my lip. This is where I get, you know when I said I get inky fingers, this is where I get it. When I've got an ink, a block, I always do it. I always ink up my own fingers. That's why I'm, I'm holding it really tentatively because it drives me nuts. Right, okay, so my bear's going approximately there. I'm not being too, you know, it's approximate. If it's not exactly, it's fine for me. I mean, of course you can take your time, but I quite like them if they're not like 100%. I think they look quite cool. So I've got them. He is going to be stuck on because if I wanted um, him to overlay and I was stamping it, I would have had to create a mask for that one. I haven't, so I am going to put him over the top like this. And then this is going to sit on the top like that, isn't that cute? Right, shall I start doing a tiny bit of colouring in? Okay, um, and then our Janice will give you a quick recap. Um, seven day savers, we've got, we've got some um, fabulous seven day savers, obviously. Seven day savers, as the name suggests, are only available for seven days. We've got um, Pink Frog. Now, this is your beautiful pearlescent card stock. You've got 50 sheets there, 300 GSM. There's loads you can do with that size of card as well. Um, only nine pounds and 99p, bargain. We've then got wonderful quickie glue pens. Um, you're getting five quickie glue pens here. Uh, for £12.60. pence, um, Always really handy for all sorts of work. So definitely, definitely worth getting in your basket. That's your quick hit glue pens. 
And then we've got, oh, what? Oh, that beautiful border stamp. Now, this is gorgeous. This is from All and Create. Um, absolutely beautiful stamp is this one. Um, and this is one of your seven day savers. If you do want to get hold of this, do not miss out on that because it is a cracking, cracking prize. And it's a beautiful stamp. Uh, check out the website. We've got loads more seven day savers for you. So don't miss out on any of those. Right, I'm going to do some speed colouring in while our Janet shows you some beautiful finished samples over to you are Janice oh my goodness we are really busy it doesn't surprise me as soon as I saw this collection it just fell in love with it. it's absolutely fantastic so many different ways that you can use these stamps and I'm I bet I'll guarantee that when you use these each and every time you'll look at your creation and you'll have a huge big smile on your face because that's what they do. They're fun, they're quirky, they're different. Let's take you through the deals and I'll show you some of the fabulous samples to give you some inspiration. Now your one day special, we launched this at six o'clock today. We do have the complete collection for you on tonight's show and throughout of course until we sell out but let's give you the details of the one day day special. 20% uh, of the stock of the one day special has gone. You've got 34 stamps in total. Those quirky characters and their friends as well. You can use these together. You can interchange them as well. So you've got the bunny rabbit there and you've got the little girl, but you could take the bunny rabbit and maybe put it with the dog. And then maybe take the little girl and put it with the other little character on there. So you can mix and match these stamps. And that's how these have been designed. So you get the opportunity to get your inspiration from these fabulous designs by Janet they're absolutely incredible and I'm sure you're looking at these and you're seeing some of your friends in the characters you might be seeing yourself in the characters maybe your children your grandchildren as well so there's lots of fun to be had when you get these home two payments of 24 pounds and 96 pence uh, we'll take the first payment today you're saving six pounds on that price and then we'll take another payment in a month's time you don't need to do anything just wait till you get all these home after your first payment, of course, and then you can start having fun. Right, let's move on to another selection that we've got for you. This is the one that leone has been demonstrating with. Oh, how super cute is this? So many different stories you can tell um, by putting your characters together. That would be a good idea. You could actually have an adventure with all of your characters. Maybe turn them into superheroes. That would be a good idea. Uh, £32.30. 37 pence that's a freedom price everybody if you are a freedom member it means you get that discount you can still buy them if you're not a freedom member but freedom members get that extra discount there you go if you're not a freedom member 35.97 you've got your windows your puppy toys and the stand in there as well 17 stamps in total and i know you're going to have a lot of fun when you get these home name the different characters they could be bespoke to you or bespoke to your friends maybe you've got a bunch of friends and these all relate to one of them. That would be a really cool idea. 681302 is your item number for that collection. Now, your stencils will be dispatched from the 15th of June. Got a great set of stencils here. Uh, and stencils are fabulous, aren't they? Because if you need that extra inspiration, if you need that extra layer to your project, and you're not quite sure where to go with your own pens then let the stencil do it for you and with the stencils you could just do the whole stencil if you wish it creates a scene you've got the sun the flowers and you've got the cloud but you can also divide it up so you could just use the flowers if you want to maybe the sun doesn't have to be a sun it could be a shape and then you could doodle around that if you want to the same with the cloud and the flowers I guess uh, let's show you the other designs that you've got there isn't that lovely bursting full of leaves and foliage let's turn that that way there's no right or wrong way to your stencil and you've got those lovely dandelion clocks as well now in this collection do love this design let me show you this very on trend at the moment do you know why because what i'm seeing there rainbows so that would be really nice lots of people creating rainbow signs at the moment putting them in the doorways putting them in the windows maybe making cards for people this is something a little bit different if you want to create a rainbow from there you've got the stars in there the moon uh, the kisses your interpretation of whatever it wants to be uh, when you get them home 17 pounds and 97 pence great price for all three however how about going for all of the stamps 
and all of those stencils. That's what so many of you are doing. I don't blame you. It's an incredible collection. Almost a quarter of the stock has gone. We're 14 minutes into the first live hour of your one day special. That's your price, saving five pounds on that deal. Uh, but you can divide the cost on Flexi three payments. Isn't that great? So I think about your budget each month. What's your budget for craft? It might be. 30 pounds might be 35 pounds what we'll do for you is you'll get the whole collection instead of dividing the collection over three months and having a show in a month's time and then you get more and then having another show if you like me you just want it now don't you You want to have your cake and eat it too so have all of the collection but we'll divide the cost over three months but of course we'll be giving you all of your collection in one go right Let's move on down. This is a collection that we have seen before. Lots of fun, though. Um, for those of you that haven't seen it before, we've got those quirky characters in there again. We've got the additional characters. I mean, look at that flower, for example. They're looking at each other. You can have that flower and maybe mix it up with one of the other characters that you've got on there as well. This is a great collection. Two payments of £24.97 and also a great deal for you. I uh, love these characters. Because with them, you can use these for your planners. You could use these for cards. You can use them for home decoration as well. When you've got all your characters lined up, maybe have them in a long line. Maybe, how about this? Wrapping paper, create your own. Gift tags, create your own. How about ribbon? If you use some fabric ink, if you've got some ribbon, and just line up all of your characters. Maybe telling a story. Maybe on a piece of paper that you roll up and then unfurl it, and then it tells a story of all the characters. 772873 is your item number if you want to go for the set of seven A7 stamp sets right here. Uh, 20, uh, no, 35 stamps in total. That's incredible. Another stamp set you might want to consider. If you're going for the collections and you're putting them on FlexiBuy, then if Anything else that you add to your basket now will be divided into three if you're going for that complete collection um, or two if you're going for the one day special now this is a beautiful set of stamps it's only 9.99 so it's a great chance to get this at a discount today especially if you're adding it to your basket and then it'll give you um, a chance to split the cost if you want to over your flexi buy payments now we've got some photos you've sent them in if you still want to send your photos you're more than welcome to do so it's studio at hochanda.com oh this is love this is what i mean by unfurling just opening up a whole story this is by sue oh, i love that love the colors you've used in there as well sue that is absolutely brilliant really really is so thank you sue for sending that in uh, we've got some more pictures sent in again please do send in your inspirations Oh, that's lovely. Uh, that one's from Cass. Oh, look at that. I love the background. Oh, every bunny needs some bunny sometimes. Oh, that is so lovely. I like the shadow effect on there as uh, well. I don't know if no that's actually raised up, Leonie, yeah, on the foam are. pads. And they're the new ones as well. Yeah. That's the new ones. That looks great. Are oh, thanks, Cass, for sending that in. Thank great you. Great That looks like you, Leonie. Oh, is that me? Yeah. She's got a, a yeah, look at the fringe. Her fringe is way more tamed. <laughs> <laughs> My fringe at the minute. Oh, lockdown hair. Oh, that is so... Don't talk to me about lockdown hair. I look like Left Garrett. Um, <laughs> right. <laughs> <laughs> no, you uh, don't. Have we got any more pictures? Ah, that's it for now. But send your pictures in, studio at hochanda.com. Let's head back to Leone for more demonstrations. But everyone, we are busy. It's a good idea to get your baskets checked out now whilst you're watching Leone. Here she is. Thank you so much. And thank you, everyone, for sending those pictures in. I love seeing what you've been doing. It's really inspirational. And I know um, Abs and the team will love it as well. So, yeah, keep those coming in. OK, so I've been colouring in. You do get carried away with these. But that's the beautiful thing about them. You know, you can spend hours colouring in. It's just quite joyous um and the the cute they can be i mean i'm doing the teddy bear in just browns you know bright brown burr it's just a brown traditional burr but i mean it doesn't need to be you know you can literally do whatever color you want i'm just working off the pencil crane just adding a couple of highlights there so just making it a bit darker in the sort of in the shady bits if you will you shady bits there we go and just going around the top. So it's just adding a little bit of dimension so it's not 
absolutely flat like so i've been mixing it up i've been working with watercolor pencils but i've also been working with pens um so i've been working with phil's pens actually and then um watercolor pencils i like doing that because well you get lots of different sort of looks you know lots of different um finishes and like because things like the the nose you want the nose a little bit darker so it's nice to add a little bit with the the pen i mean you can add so much detail with these the choice is yours with their eyes i must admit i don't go in with the pen on the eyes because i can get those very very wrong the eyes so i like to go with a pencil and just gently go around there with the pencil because i really like that then i think that looks really pretty with a dress i had to wait for it to dry but see i start faffing faff 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 love it okay so i'm trying to put lid back on pencil there that's from my water brush okay so happy with that but of course it's like well that's not a scene yet you have to build it into a scene so I thought the way to do this is exactly the way we've worked on the front. So on the front, we've got the, the beautiful stencil, but why not use that inside as well? Because inside, I thought, it's the wallpaper, isn't it? You know, it's whatever you want it to be. So you have to have something going on inside as well. So I'm going to use exactly the same stencil, but a different colour on this one. So if I go on with my pinks, I were going to tidy up, but I haven't done that yet. See, this is the problem. You start and you never tidy up because <laughs> it just it just builds up and builds up. So getting my, my pink and I just thought with this. Now, I haven't made masks out of these. So rather than the masks, I do need to be a bit careful. So just watching where I stencil. So just going around the images. And I mean, straight away, you start filling in. Straight away, you start building up that beautiful, beautiful scene. And I think these stencils, for just building up backgrounds, for, for them picking out specific elements with these stencils, they're absolutely beautiful. I mean, that one is so handy. Those two are just amazing. Because they just, before you know it, you're building up a really, really cool little scene. See how good are they? So just pop in the little stencil and I'm not going over the image. I can see through the stencil. So I know that I'm, I'm not going over the image. So I'm not going to ruin the image. I haven't cleaned that stencil. So I know I'll, so I'll get a bit of purple going on there. But actually that looks really quite nice. So I'll repeat it up here as well. So using the pink, but dragging a bit of the blue. There we go. I'm so pleased you love these as much as we do. We do. We think they're fab. And then just going on that corner like so. Just put these coming on down here like this. Okay, happy with that. So, got that. So we've got the background going on here. I quite like that. I quite like it not being full of colour, you know, because obviously we could go in sort of and add even more colour, but I, I quite like having a little bit of a light to this, a bit of open space. So if I just bring my ink around the edges, so rather than going in too much, I think that'll look really pretty. But then what I want to do is, so while I've got that out, I'm going to bring in, let me just find my little stamp. So I've got fly here. So the other beautiful thing is with these, you've got loads of gorgeous little sentiments. So let's use the fly as part of our background. So just randomly stamping that one over the stencil image, like so. So she's got fly, 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 fly. And then we'll have on the other one, where's the love stamp? There's a love stamp. And then the other one will have the little love stamp. So just using it as the background and it works so nicely as the background. So just having the little love stamp there. See, doesn't that look pretty? I love the fact that with these, they're a really good size. So if you are going to use these like I did with me, um, journal, I've got a pl well, planner. Um, your planner pages, they work an absolute treat with my planner pages. So I love that. It really sits in well, doesn't it? And it's so quick. It just builds up so quickly. So happy with that. Now, you could put 
you know, a little um, sort of the, the floor on there if you wanted to. By, you know what I mean, it, you could have a little, you know, the carpet, if you will. You don't have to, though. You know, it doesn't have to be literal. There's a lot of times that you look at them, you can sort of see lines that you can use for the floor. Like with that one, you know, you could have that as a floor. I'm not going to faff with that this time. But there are a lot of little elements that you can look at. Like the top of that one. You know, the top of that could be, should we do with that? So rather than talking about it, let's do it. So you could actually take that and make it into your floor. So if I just take that one off there, I love the lemonade stand. I just think that is such a fab little stamp. It's ace. So I only want, so I'm only bothered about part of it. And it's all about the inking. So just, if I just ink, and you can be quite specific, just inking, coming round and hitting the top. So that means, how much time have I got? Whew, five minutes. That has gone ridiculously quick. Look, see, so he's just got a little board there. It looks like he's going to jump. But it looks like, remember at school, them things that you jumped off at school? What were they? You know, in gymnastics. <laughs> Every, we know what we mean, but nobody knows what they were. Horse. horse. Looks like a little horse. See, it's my gymnastic teddy bear. Who knew I was creating gymnastic teddy bears on TV today? Just dragging a little bit of colour there. So it's got a bit of shading. Hold on. Faffing, folks. Right, let me pop this together. Okay. And then... Let's pop our fantastic, one of my favourite characters in the whole lot. <laughs> Look at him, he's well ace. He's ace, isn't he? He just looks like in pure shock. <laughs> uh, love it. And you see, really, you I mean, you could take the heart out of there and she could be, could be carrying a, a, du a mad duck, couldn't she? Do you know what I mean? You could really play with these. You could really play with the, the different, um, the characters. Oh, it's just, that finishes everything, doesn't it? It's like, boom, so uh, no, you don't need to do any more on that. You've put the magic, um, the magic chicken on. <laughs> love him. OK, let's get the front of the card. Oh, you see now I love that because you can see his little face peeping round. I would put drop shadows. I'm not going to faff about with drop shadows. The front of the card now, whereas the, the obviously inside the card, we've put loads of little elements here. We need to put some on the front of the card. So let's have a little see. So we've got with brave thick wings she flies. I really like that one. Glitter's my favorite color, besties. See, I like that one, besties. So we're having besties, okay. And I'll bring the blue one for this. So just go around the edge. I'm gonna finish this. How much time have I got? Two and a half minutes, I will finish this. Okay, so that's gonna be my besties. And then what I'll do, just because I can, let's take that love. So as we did before, we'll stamp this just nice and random. Now a quarter of the stock has gone. If you do want that full collection, please, please, please check out your baskets. It is ridiculously busy. We're really chuffed because obviously we know the quirky and sometimes people don't like quirky. We happen to adore quirky and we are so pleased you adore quirky too. Um, oh, we're in the right... This is the right place, isn't it? We're amongst quirky friends. So thank you very much indeed. Janet's work is fantastic. It's so up my street, it's ridiculous. Right, OK, I'm going to put besties on. I'll double 3D that in a moment. Just move all my sentiments. So the way I'm going to put these together, I've got washi tape. I had washi tape on the other day. It was, um, what show were it? Memory box. It was my memory box. And I just thought, you know what? Boom, this is going to be amazing to put this together because I really think it'll work as well. So I'll pop my little old washer on there, like so. Pretty. And then take it off the table and pop it on here, like this. Okay. Just put those together, like there. Happy. And then pull that over. Lovely thing is we wash it. If you do it wrong, just take it back off again. Boom. How cute is that? So then when you open it up, yay! You could decorate the inside. You could also put your washi, if you wanted the washi on here, you could then just put your washi on here 
as well. The other colour I've got look rather nice. And the lovely thing is with washi, obviously, it'll bend beautifully. So when you score that, you'll get that gorgeous little score. And then just to finish this off, 3D foam. Don't know where I've put it. Oh, I don't know I put my 3D foam. That's annoying. So I'll just put it on with this. Then pop in my little besties on the top. Oh, I'm going to faff because I don't know where to put it. There. Isn't that cute? Shall I hold it up? <laughs> As my best is not, I haven't fallen off yet. But there you go. How cute is that? So you can see your little characters and then when you open it up, look at them. Aren't they just amazing? Um, right, do check your baskets out. This collection is ace. I mean, it's just ace. Um, join me again at eight o'clock. Thank you very much.